Hey dolls, so I am back. So this is gonna be a jewelry video for all of the new jewelry pieces that I have picked up. And y'all know your girl be coming with the bling and the hookup on the jewelry. So if you wanna see what I got and where I got it from, then keep on watching. Okay dolls, so first we're gonna start off with the pieces that I'm actually wearing today. So I have this Cuban link necklace bomb.com and then i also have the matching bracelet this one is a different kind of cuban link if you can see how the links are they're kind of like regular and then you have this special kind of um link as well that goes throughout i thought that was really cute and it kind of gave it more of a girly vibe i have a regular baguette cuban link with my name on it so i wanted something different um and yeah so i picked this one so i got it in silver of course and then i also have the matching bracelet so i will link that down below if you guys are interested but i did pick it up from aliexpress and let me just go over prices in this video as well so let me just pull up my recent orders and we could talk about that in this video also because it's a deal and a steal if you know what i'm saying these items are the miami baguette Zircoin iced out Cuban link. So the necklace was $39.64 and the bracelet was $24.51, which is really, really affordable because I've paid more for items like this before. So this one was pretty affordable and I kind of shop around on the website and try to find one that's reasonably priced, but I don't always go for the cheapest priced one because sometimes the quality won't be bum. Okay, so I'll link that down below so y'all could get this good quality that I have and it does come in other colors I believe okay so let me just show you the next pieces that I picked up so I really have been wanting these blinged out Cartier bracelets and I happen to find them on AliExpress as well so let me just do a close-up so you can see how they look so these are the bracelets they look really pretty on. For the Cartier bracelets, they are really easy to apply and people pay so much for these. And honey, I would never go and spend all my coins on a bracelet. Like you can find it for the low low. Like why spend so much money these days, especially for something like this. Like I'm definitely gonna wear it and get my money's worth out of it. But honey, I'm gonna have me some money in the bank too at the same time, okay? But these are actually marked Cartier. So they are, a, you know, actually a dupe. So yeah, these are Cartier inspired bracelets. These are pretty tiny, but they aren't too small that they don't fit my wrist and they're great for stacking with other things. Like I totally could wear it today with this if I wanted to. Um, I've stacked it with something else that I'm gonna show you in the video in a moment. And also another way to stack this is to put all of them together, the silver, the gold, and the rose gold. I got them to do that with sometimes, especially when I wanna wear like my normal silver necklace, but I'm using a bag with gold in it or maybe my shirt or something. I don't know, just whenever I wanna kinda mix the metals, I picked up these for that reason. But y'all know I mostly wear silver. So the silver one will probably get the most love. This is the only one that I've worn so far. So those are those. I also have these solid ones that have the stones in it as well, like the solid gold, solid silver. Those are really old, so I didn't pull those back out. These are the newer style that I was going with. So yeah, I will link those down below as well. The Cartier Inspired bracelets were $15.94 a piece which is kind of pricey whenever you want to buy all of them but whenever you think about the original price of the other one it's really not that bad to pay that much and it's something you can you know get a lot of use out of by stacking and stuff like that and then next i picked up these christian dior necklace and bracelets so this is the necklace on the silver one So as you can see, the logo looks really nice and the metal is a nice weight to it as well. And then also at the end, this little piece actually does say Dior on it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to pick it up on camera. But yeah, that little piece does say Dior on it. So I have the silver necklace with the silver um, bracelet. 
and then i also did get it in gold as well so i have the gold necklace and the gold bracelet and y'all know i always have to get both especially because it was such a good deal for these they were $4.99 a piece which is so cheap five dollars a piece for the bracelets and for the necklaces they were $5.99 a piece so six dollars so super affordable really easy to be able to own all of them and they do have a nice weight to them i actually wore the silver necklace and bracelet and i paired it with the cartier bracelet um and i wore that out this past sunday so yeah it was real cute and it gave me the vibe that i was looking for so i'm definitely glad i picked it up at first i wasn't really sure what the quality was going to be but it's given okay so that is that and then i also picked up some earrings if y'all know um, from one of my other jewelry videos, I had those really large hoops with the stones in them. And they're just really big and cute and just popping. But I found some more that look even more real, like real diamond hoops. So I picked these up. They are smaller, however. I do wish that they had bigger ones. But these are cute and they kind of give me like rich mommy vibes. Because y'all know your girl and mommy now. So... Yes, yeah, so these are the hoops. So let me just get close so y'all can see this bling action. So cute. And this is going to be perfect with all of my different necklaces and stuff like that. And I also like that the diamonds are here as well. So you will be able to see the diamonds from the front and then also here. If someone is looking at you from behind, there are no stones this way. They are facing towards the front. So this is perfect for my girls who have longer hair or even if you rock a bob, most of the time your hair is covering the hoop anyway and you don't really care how it looks from the back it's more so the front so i do like that it has the diamonds that face towards the front and the way that you actually put this on is you press down on this little piece and then you pull it open and then whenever you put it through your ear you're just going to pop this back together and it snaps into place and then it's going to be locked in so you don't have to worry about your hoops falling out or anything like that and the way that it clasps is more so like a real diamond hoop earring if you know what i'm saying so i picked up the silver ones i believe these are 50 or 65 centimeters let me just pull these up these are 60 millimeters and it says that they are big CZ Huggy Hoop Earrings. I believe they have these in smaller sizes as well. But I got the gold and the silver color in these. So these are the silver ones. And they look so real. Like they're bomb. They have some other ones online that I was looking at picking up. But I wanted to try these out first. And I wasn't really sure if they were going to be a size that was suitable for me. Because I don't like small hoops. But I wasn't mad at this size. So these are the gold ones. And this is a nice size. Like it's not too big, not too small. Let me just kind of hold it up to show y'all how it fits on me. So you can kind of see how big it is. And this is a 60 centimeter. I believe the ones that I usually get are about 70 or 80. I think like 80 centimeters. So the other ones are pretty big compared to these. But these are good for like everyday wear. Um, because they're not too big. So those are those. Actually, I almost forgot to show y'all. I got this bangle bracelet as well. And this one has the screw with the rhinestones in it. Um, I have one like this. But these stones are different. And it doesn't have like... It's not this big of a screw. Like I can't really explain it. But this one has like an extra row or whatever. Um, but yeah, on this side it is just plain silver. But this side is blinged out so you can see it there so super cute i like this one as well and i thought this will be cute to stack and pair with the cartier bracelets and i think this one was around like 17 dollars or 18 dollars so that's all of that i did want to grab these pieces to add in because these are like my everyday pieces and i'm always getting questions about where they are from so first of all, this necklace, this tennis necklace is from Gold Presidents. I do have the ones that are from AliExpress as well. I will link that one down below. I don't have it right here with me, but the stones are kind of bigger. This one looks more realistic. Um, and I like these with these particular pendants. So this pendant is a block letter pendant. And I actually got the pendant from AliExpress. 
So I think this is great. Like if you have a daughter or a son or a kid or a baby or whatever, this is real cute for you to wear because a block glitter just kind of symbolizes like more so for a kid. Or also this will be really cute like if you have a daughter or a son um, and you could get a chain that's shorter and maybe if they're bigger, not like small, like my baby, this will be also cute for them to wear, like especially for a little boy. I think that would be really cute. So this is the block glitter pendant. I got an A for Amiri and then I also have this one as well and I also have an A for Amiri's name. So this one is just a really pretty cursive a and i thought it was just so pretty and i also wear this one on the same chain so sometimes i switch it out and wear either or um so yeah i have both of those as well and this one is from aliexpress as well this pendant was probably like seven or eight dollars these were no more than twelve dollars i'm pretty sure like ten dollars at the most maybe so yeah i'll link those down below as well because y'all are always asking where those are from all right y'all so y'all don't know this but i had to go take a little break because my baby got up so everything that i'm going to show you now is from sylviex and this is a personalized jewelry company so you can get like necklaces bracelets stuff like that with your name or whatever you want to get on it i got some items for me and i got some items for my baby so i actually picked up this piece for myself but after i got it and i saw how small and dainty it is I said I will probably just cut it down and go ahead and make it a necklace for her or we'll just save it um, for her to have for later. But it actually has her name on it. So it looks like this. It's probably kind of hard to see, but it has like the different letters dangling on it. So it has her name on it. So it's A-M-I-R-I. -I, um, and you would just wear it like that, you know. And it's real dainty and small. Like I thought it would be a good everyday necklace for me, but it's so small and dainty i don't know if i will wear it because y'all know i'm a little bit more flashy even on an everyday kind of basis but yeah i don't know if i do wear it i will probably pair it up with something else as well but i had got this one for myself but it'll probably end up being for my baby and then also for myself i picked up um this stacked kind of nameplate necklace and i didn't have one like this other than my old one that i had from back back in the day so this one looks like this and i'm just keeping them in the box so y'all can kind of really see but it says cooch on it like that and this one is two-tone so you have like the silver and the gold and i wanted that two-tone look because most of the time i do wear silver but Sometimes I wear gold and I thought it would be cool to have like the two-tone vibe. And this one is really nice. It's nice stacked and thick. So it kind of gives that 3D appearance where it's kind of going to push out because it is stacked. And then the chain is nice on it as well. I probably would have preferred a thicker chain. But I'm glad that it's not as skinny as some chains. So that's the chain and everything for that one. And then I also did get the matching earrings to go with it and these earrings are real cute they're smaller than what i normally wear but they are kind of similar to like the other hoops that i showed y'all like as far as sizing let me just try to see actually i think these are a little bit bigger like just a tad so this is how they look so i got cooch on these as well and then you can see that they have the stones on them so they are blinged out and gold but then you also have the silver on there as well so it's two-tone and i wanted my uh, nameplate and my hoops to match like back in the day but mine's actually it had my first name on it that's what i wanted back in the day but this time i got it where it says cooch and my other one used to be just silver and the um hoops didn't have the stones in them but this is so cute so i got that for myself and then also for my baby i got this item let's see what it is because i had this stuff for a long time she hasn't actually worn her jewelry yet it's actually a little bit tarnished like i need to clean it because it's just been in the box for so long but this one has her name on it let's see if y'all can even see it there we go so this one has her name on it and it has a crown above the a so this is really cute. My baby's name is Amiri, if anyone didn't know or y'all haven't picked up on that yet. But this one is really cute and I did get it in a shorter length so that she can actually be able to wear it. Um, but she just hasn't 
put it on yet because we really don't go anywhere. And then also I got her this necklace and it just has an A with a crown on top. Y'all know I love crowns and stuff. I do wish that the A could have been capitalized, but they only had it in a lowercase letter. But then I think it is also cute because it's for a little girl, like it's a lowercase A. I don't know. It's cute though, but I kind of would have preferred a capital A. So she has that necklace also. And then um, lastly, I have a bracelet as well. And this bracelet is real cute but yeah then she also has this little bracelet and it is like a cuff like you can uh loosen it up or tighten it up and it just has her middle name on it and these are already kind of like tarnishing a little bit so i should definitely put them back inside of the bag because i do see kind of like some of that brownish tinge on them you know like how jewelry kind of gets after a while so i would say just keep your stuff stored in the bag and seal it tight um, but you can always clean it and I have jewelry cleaner. So eventually, probably whenever she does actually wear the pieces, I'll need to clean them first. But yeah, so those are all of the items that I got from Sylvia X. Also, I almost forgot that I got these pieces from Yafini. I will link them down below as well. I got a matching anklet for me with the necklace for my daughter. So she'll have the necklace and then I have the anklet and they both just say her middle name on it. So I got this. And her middle name is Dior and I got it in the print that is similar to like the brand Dior because I thought that was really cute. Now I found the other one. So I just kind of wrote on the back of the card me so I would know which one was mine. So you can see they both look exactly the same. They're in the plastic but mine is an ankle bracelet and hers is a necklace. So yeah you can get something like the same font with the same wording or whatever as your daughter or son or whatever like that and it's just real cute and personalized so i had these pieces for a long time like way before i even had her i had ordered this super long time ago and i wanted to say i had something else but I can't remember so yeah and I believe those are all of the other jewelry pieces that I wanted to show y'all today so yeah that pretty much concludes this video I got some really good bougie type pieces that don't break the bank and then we got some really cute personalized stuff as well so I will put links down below to all of the items that I've showed you in this video today and if you dolls have any questions leave them down below and don't forget to like comment and subscribe bye dolls <laughs>